Norwich City. Bristol City have wrestled possession back though, and they've got it on the left-hand side. Just moving the ball back towards the halfway line in order to keep it, but that is strong play there from Sienax to steal it on halfway and bring it forward. He's played the pass behind Schwartel, but the danger puts the brakes on, catches up with the ball and then finds Sainz, who pushes it to Sienax on the edge of the penalty area, into the box he goes, gets the shot away, it's charged down, it doesn't quite run for Marcondes, and it's cleared away. A real spirited play there from Ante Sienax, who struggled a little bit up front in the last couple of games, filling in for Josh Sargent, he put himself about there, Doyle now caresses it forward, Marcondes is in with the header! That was excellent centre forward play from Emiliano Marcondes. He got beyond the Bristol City defence, got onto a bouncing ball, nodded it past the goalkeeper, and over the post. Denied Marcondes uh, the goal there in Norwich Hammond Corner. Sight sets off, he skipped past Earthy. He's still going, excellent challenge in the end comes in. McNally, but a careless pass there from McGuay, and Sykes is battling away for it with Earthy, and really putting Bristol City under pressure, but the visitors have cleared it away. They've worked it up to halfway, and Max Bird. Sorensen goes to meet him, Bird holds him off, and then hoists the ball over to the left-hand side. Fisher's got to get across here to Roberts, who's on the march for Bristol City. Infield it goes, Mimetti up towards the edge of the penalty area, gets the shot, he left-footed, and he squeezed it into the net! Long couldn't get down and keep it out, and it's Anis Mimetti, the former Norwich City youngster, who has finished from the edge of the penalty area. The first effort Bristol City have really had on goal in this game, and they've taken the lead after 15 minutes. Norwich nil, Bristol City 1. Sorensen swivels, holds off the challenge there of Bird. The Canaries on the front foot now with Marcondes. Played in behind the defence, Sainz is onside. To the left of goal, by the byline now Sainz. Gives the pass to Doyle, into the six-yard box, kicked away by the goalkeeper. Uh, and now Sorensen is brought down, and that's a free kick to Norwich City. Only about 25 yards out, maybe a little bit more than that, to the left of centre. A bit of positive play there from Norwich. Sainz timed his run well, and all he did there was knocking back to Doyle, who fed it into the six-yard box, and then you're just hoping for a touch, a deflection, something like that. The goalkeeper was able to clear. Marcondes is up to the ball now, strikes the free kick on target, but it's a comfortable save for the goalkeeper who put himself in the front position. He just had to hop just to his right and he caught the ball quite comfortably. Here's Sainz on halfway. Gives it to Marcondes. Sienatz available to the right hand side. Here's Ante Sienatz up towards the edge of the penalty. Area. Fisher on the overlap. Sienatz is going to go for goal through a crowd of players. Keeper makes the save. Marcondes is saying he should have rolled that to the right with Fisher, but it's a shot on target and it's just got supporters believing a little bit. I think Norwich is going to make a double change. Norwich moving the ball more quickly now, certainly than they were in the first half. Schwartel into the midfield and Slimani. Now it's with Duffy in the centre circle. Duffy gets the ball out towards the right-hand side, but sells Jack Stacey short. And Mimetti plays it forward for Bristol City, and there could be trouble here for Norwich, with Jason Knight now setting off, cutting in from the left-hand side, 25 yards from goal, pass into the penalty area for Naki Wells! 2-0! That is an emphatic finish, and it all comes from Norwich City giving the ball away on the halfway line. Quick break from Bristol City, just the sort of incisive play that Norwich haven't been able to put into their game today, and Wells finishes with a flourish, and Norwich's unbeaten home record is in big trouble. Norwich City nil, Bristol City 2. Here's Kriseni to Fisher on the left-hand side. In front of him is Borja Sainz. Sainz curls the ball into the penalty area. Macondes gets his head to it. And it's gone out wide towards this right-hand side. It came off a defender Great last cross. of all, so Norwich will get a corner, maybe. Great cross from Sainz there as well. You know what I mean? Like yeah. Macondes tried to get the head in whatever like, but well defended. 2-0 down, 13 minutes to go, floated corner towards the far post from Marcondes, header just over the top, I think, did the keeper touch it? No, looked like he did from here, but ball kick him. No chance, great ball in, Duffy at the far post, it's come off the top of the bar I think as well, trying to lean over his, uh, his, uh, his opponent. Anasov Torop is going to lose at Carra Road for the first time as Norwich City head coach. We've seen some really thrilling games at Carrow Road this season. We've seen some really thrilling games this year, but after a year and four days, Norwich City's proud unbeaten home record comes.
to a crushing halt. And it was Bristol City who did the job on them today.